Hi, my name is Nikita Rowling. I am representing myself and I will be uh, performing The Queen's Gambit, uh, season one, episode five, uh, named Fork, and I'll be performing the role of Beth, starting from now. Hey, breakfast is almost ready. I've already taught you everything I know, which admittedly is not a lot. I've got to start studying. I'm supposed to be an electrical engineer, not a chess one. Where are you going to go? I'm leaving to that apartment. It's closer to the university. I'm going to leave you. You're wrong, you know. You taught me a lot. I'm really glad you called. I'm glad I could be here with you, you know, after you lost your mum. It's more than that. You really helped me. I guess you've helped me too. You've helped me realise something. What? That I don't love chess. No, it's okay. I just don't love it as much as I once did. I'm not obsessed with it in the way one has to be to win it all. The way you are, I'm going to leave you. This. You have a lot in common. Really? Morphine was a liar or something in New Orleans. You look at his game, the way he plays. He sacrificed knights and bishops like he had a dozen instead of two. And then he moved in on the king so fast, his opponents would just freeze up. It's too bad. If Morphine and Kablanka hadn't been alive at the same time, they could have played each other. Yeah, it's too bad Morphy fell into a muttering paranoia and died. He would stay up all night in Paris before his games, drinking in cafes and talking to strangers. And then he played the next day like a shark, well-mannered, well-dressed, moving the pieces with this, these small, ladylike hands, crushing one European master after another. You know what they called him? The pride and the sorrow of chess. And then he retired at 22. And you think that's going to be me? I think that is you. I think maybe it's always been you. Be careful, Beth.